Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Rosie and I'm a recent graduate of the University of Oxford. I'm currently on a gap year. We are in quarantine right now, but I should be working in a school. I'm working from home and it's actually Easter holidays, so there's no work anyway. Next year I am doing an MSc in Forensic Archaeology and Anthropology at Cranfield University, which is down in Bedfordshire. And I have quite a bit of work to do for that, so I thought I would film a study with me today. <laughs> my task for the day is to finish my scholarship application and also to do my online course day for today. Um, I'm on week two of a Forensic Arcananth course run by Durham on futurelearn.com, so I need to do that as well. So I'm gonna bring you along to hopefully motivate you to do some work as well, maybe? Or mostly just so that I have to do my work because it is going on the internet. Before I start, I just wanted to point out that it is 11.24am and I haven't done any work yet. So, you know, we're not having an early start, we're just trying to be as productive as we can in our own time. <laughs> yeah. through on the ground <laughs> I found that I was basically not taking any of the information in anymore because I'd stared at it on a screen for far too long so now it is printed out and I've made some quick changes on there as you saw and now I'm just gonna add them to the actual document so that I've changed it <laughs> So it's break time now and I'm going to do a HIIT workout, I'm going to do Natasha Ocean 15 minute HIIT I'm doing it on FaceTime with my best friend from school Hello I'm going to get it up on my phone
hours later. Right, it is time for our afternoon work session now. It is actually 3pm. I had a big break for my workout and then lunch and a shower. We're gonna get on with it now. So I've got this to do, which is week two of my forensic archaeology and anthropology course. And I need to finish my scholarship application. I've got some corrections on here to add to my actual document and basically when, when I get bored of this I'll go on to do my, my course. I've got my study snacks as well, I've got a hobnob, some grapes and some of my easter egg because it was easter yesterday. Yeah let's get on with it. <laughs> finally finished my scholarship application and if you've been following my channel you know this has taken me ages because I've been obviously working alongside trying to do it but it's finally done I need to do like another check through just make sure it all flows properly but I'm going to have a break now I'm gonna go for my my daily walk enjoy the sunshine for 20 minutes 30 minutes come back and do my online course I've just started a second one Actually, so obviously I'm doing the friends clock and anth one, but I've just started another one in facial reconstruction, which I thought was really interested in, and I've never kind of looked into before. So I'm excited about that. I'm gonna do them both at the same time. This this new one's only two weeks, so it's less work than the other one. Oh my gosh, that spider! I swear to. There's a spider, and I know it's the same one because it, it's weird looking, right? And it was in my right. I found it. I'm not even gonna lie. In my bed. I wasn't in the bed at the time. I was on it, but it came from inside my bed, and I freaked out a little bit because was it in there when I was sleeping? We don't know. I put it outside, that like, on my window ledge, and it is. Can you see it? Oh, I'm gonna. It is here. Where are you? There. On my window again. We're gonna have to have words, Mr. Spider. It's a, it's a weirdly sinister looking one. Anyway, back to the point. I've edited, I've edited a video whilst I was waiting. And I'm actually gonna go for a walk now. My walk was just around the block but there were some absolutely beautiful trees out at the moment and loads of flowers. I think everyone's been doing gardening so everyone's gardens look amazing. <laughs> When I got back I made my tea, I kind of made a sort of curry thing, just a load of vegetables, a lot of garlic and some yoghurt curry paste and a little bit of peanut butter. I add noodles to my curries, I think I prefer them with noodles and because it's got coconut in and peanut butter it's sort of more of a Thai curry anyway, as opposed to a korma, even though I use that. <laughs> Alright, back to work, time to start week two of my course while it's still lovely and light. What do you like once the sun goes down and you have to use non-natural light it really cuts motivation down for me so we're gonna get as much done now. I'm going to try and get half of week two done so that I can relax a bit more for the rest of the week. <laughs>
actually managed to do half of the tasks because there was way more tasks than I expected there to be. But I have done, so you get this screen when you're on it. I've done all of the ones in blue, so I thought, oh, this is a short week. But then if you scroll down, there's actually loads. <laughs> but I've got four out of the six from part one yeah, done. And now my eyes and my brain are really tired, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna read my book. nine o'clock now and I am tired even my voice is tired I don't even know what's wrong with that so I'm gonna go downstairs and watch Netflix with my family we've been watching the English game for quite a while yeah thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed and I think this is like my first properly productive day in so long so if you have not had a productive day in a while then that is okay don't worry about it just you know reflect on what you have achieved and then try again the next day it's okay if you enjoyed give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more quarantine content thank you for coming i'll see you in my next video bye